I'm Debbie. Cindy. And we are Sisters and Stitches, and we are doing Cindy's Thread Up Unboxing. We are at my nephew's house because Debbie's in town for the one and a half days that this she This is comes where I'm going to be staying one night a week with my youngest son. He has a house with three bedrooms, and he let me... It's still not done yet. It's got everything thrown in here, but um, it's all my furniture from that I could fit in here. <laughs> Um, so we're sitting in my little room here. So when Cindy was trying on the clothes, which you'll see, there's Clint Eastwood and <laughs> a bar with a bunch of scotches. You can tell it's a bachelor guy. You can tell home. it's a man's home. Yeah. So he's not, um, he's not involved with anybody specifically right now. So there's no female touches here at all. Um, so thread up is a, um, go ahead. You tell them about it. Yeah. I mean, you just, it's a used clothing. I'm sure you guys all know that. And it's a $10 styling fee that gets applied towards anything that you get in the box. And I think you get like maybe 10 items or something. And, um, they used to have it where you could create your own goodie box, but I don't see that online anymore. So I just had them throw stuff in there. And I haven't done this one in quite a few months, so I thought I would give it another try. So let's And go it's a total hit or miss. I mean, it um, is. I did it, it is. once and I got I got a pair of um, got a couple lucky pair of jeans, jeans yeah. and a pair of another uh, brand name jean, but that was the only two things I kept out of the box. But you know what? For ten dollars and they send it to you, even if you don't keep anything, it's ten dollars. Do you know what I mean? It's just so fun. It's fun it's to see. Fun. You might get that little diamond. I in the almost rock. like to see what they threw in there that nobody will buy, that they're hoping somebody will buy because you're thinking what the heck did they do this for there's a couple of them let me show you my what the heck all right <sighs> let me just show this to you wow need I say more now I'm sure that there's some of you out there that really really like this but for my own personal taste my mom used to wear these Every day. This this big floral print. Now, I love the colors. I love the reds and the pinks and the black in it. I love the colors. But this style tunic just seems a little matronly for me. And it just reminds me too much of my mother. And I don't want to admit that I'm getting close to my mother's age when she was wearing shirts like this. So maybe that's what it is. She was wearing those in her 40s, though. Come on. <laughs> so, um, and how much is this? This is by Jasmine and Juliana. That retails generally for $48, and through ThreadUp, you can get it for $16.99. Okay, but I don't need to say anything more about that. Now, here is a shirt, and this is by... Oh, Vince Camuto. Okay, this is normally $48, and you can get it through ThreadUp for $14.99. So what I like about it is I like the sleeves because it, it comes down What lower. do you call those? A three-quarter length, three quarter length bell, bell sleeve? Bell sleeve, maybe. Um, and how much is this one? I'm sorry. $14.99. So $15. Bucks, but to me, to me, I love Dusty Rose, but to me... I don't think this did much for my figure, and it just seems faded. It looks me. like somebody wore the heck out of it. Yeah, and so I'm just not going to keep it. I know it's a good price point, but not for a faded no. used piece of clothing. And then the other item I thought, what the heck were they thinking? Debbie liked them. <laughs> so you guys are going to have These to These are tell Nine me. West, and I think with a black turtleneck top and a black sweatshirt. If everything around these pants is black, I think it'd be really cute. I think they're fun. They're different. Now they're they're like more of a cropped pant, not even a crop pant, but it, it hits you at the ankle, so they're supposed to be that way. But I've seen people wear boot like black booties with the ones that hit you right at the ankle. So with so this I just said, what the heck? And then Debbie's like, oh my God, those would look so cute with a black sweater and a purple turtleneck or blah, blah, blah. What do you guys think? Now, this is like a light gray background. Tell me. I like them. I think it'd be so fun with all black. Black sweater. Like that, she got a long, uh, long black sweater in her trunk club, in her trunk club mm -hmm. with a sleeveless mock black turtleneck. So she's oh. not too hot. And with those cute little pointy black shoes that's in her trunk club. I think these would look What adorable. do you guys think? I thought they looked cute on her. And and, and so those are, um, who are those? Oh, Nine West. Nine West. Yeah, so those 
Retail for $99 and you can get them $33.99 through Thread Up. So $34. Would you guys spend $34 and have some fun with these Other pants? people have spent $99 on those. Yeah, no, I wouldn't do that. But weigh in on this, because I said, what the heck? And Debbie's like, oh, no, you got to keep those pants. I think they're fun and cute. Then there was one other, what were they thinking? Now, this mm -hmm. is by Lane Bryant, and it's a short little flouncy skirt. This retails for $54 generally, and you can get it for $16.99. Okay. So it's not too bad. It doesn't, it seems a little washed out, I guess. I'm not sure. Cindy was laughing about it, but I said, actually, Cindy, that that looks kind of cute on you. Because a lot of times when Cindy's wearing skirts, they're too long in the front and shorter in the back. Finally, it's a skirt that isn't too short in the back because it's a little bit longer yeah. in the back. Yeah, that's true. But the problem with these style skirts that are kind of pleated is that it just hangs on my little shelf. <laughs> <laughs> I thought if you look at the video, I think it looked All decent right. on her. So weigh in on this one too, please. So the pants and the skirt. And then um, this is by Calvi Klein. And that retails for $60, which you can get for $14.99. I don't like it. And I, you know what it is, It's the people? same thing. It's that it's ribbing that, in that front that, that you don't like. pleating around the neckline. I just don't, I don't like it. And I think it's a little bit tight around my midsection because it's that like stretchy knit. So not a fan. Not a fan of this top. But again, royal blue, black, and white. I love that combination, but I don't think I'm going to keep that one either. And then they threw in, I, this is by Land's End. I like Land's End, but it's just a blue cotton tank top. Yeah, and they top. say it retails for $48, and she can get it for $15. I mean, my gosh, it's a blue tank top. You can get that anywhere for I don't seven or eight bucks. Yeah, I can <laughs> get it from... Uh, in fact, I went to Old Navy and picked up some tanks and some T-shirts, and I got them for like 5 or $6. Yeah, so that's, that's kind of you know, pricey they, for what it is. I don't know. Maybe they were hoping somebody would buy it. I'm not a big Land's End fan anyway. Okay, then I did not try these on for you because I couldn't zip them up. And these are petite. It's my size, but they just didn't fit right. I don't know who they're by because the tag's not in here. It just says dress pants. They retail for $60 and you can get them for $25. So they don't know what brand it is because the tag's cut out. They don't even list it there, but they listed it for $60. So I don't know. But these are just a standard blue pair of pants. Which even if they fit and I could zip them up and they they show smell, you guys. Smell them. Well, they thread smell up fun. always do. I think it's like, I don't know. But so that's, these, a, that's a big heck no. Heck no. Okay, and then -E -W I like picks. this one. This is by Eloquy. Yeah, that look cute on you. And this is just like a little pencil skirt. Now that they said retails for $71, which we know that's true looking at Cindy's Trunk Club. And it retails, she can get it for $17. Right, and it's got these little like elastic things here so I think it's really cute and it's just I do have a black skirt similar to this but it's shorter so I always had to wear tights like black tights with it because I felt it was too short for work but this comes down to my knees so I think this would be more appropriate for work so I really like these pair them with a pair of tights and some boots I think I'm keeping this so what do you guys think of this box? I mean, and it's and also I think it says if you spend $75 on your clothes, you'll get a $10 credit put into your um your thread up account. So, I think I'm keeping the black skirt that I showed you. I'm going to keep What else was I going to keep? I think you should oh, consider yeah. the pants. She wants me to consider the pants. So if I get an overwhelming majority that sides with her, because I think, what the heck, and she's thinking, no, they're fun. I think they're fun. So Different from the rest of the stuff in her closet. I will let you guys weigh in. I still have a few days to get this back, because you do get seven days. She loves purple, so the black is slimming, and the purple are in the pants. So if she wore black on her upper body, it would slim her down. So even though the pants are really fun, um, it would still be a slimming outfit. So this box is okay. There were quite, there were some what are they thinking, but it's fun for ten dollars. You can't go wrong. So, so go. that's her thread up used clothing box. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to go to Goodwill yourself. 
So we did hit our goal of 2,000. Thank you all who Yes, yeah, so and we're going to um, do a giveaway, us. and it's a themed giveaway. A giveaway. A giveaway. A giveaway. <laughs> So we're going to do a themed one. Give it away, and give it's it away, be, give it away now. It's going to be give a, away, a uh, hey, it's going to be a, <laughs> a so long to a summer, because even though summer doesn't end till the third week in September, after Labor Day, summer's pretty much over as far as all the festivities and stuff. So it'll be a bye-bye to summer box <laughs> and a hello fall. So you want to hit the notify bell because you'll want to join in. So really put some thought into this box all right you'll want to stay tuned all right ladies thanks for spending a few minutes with us and we will catch you in the next video bye bye